Hello guys and welcome to another video. Now in this video we are going to be having a look at the 10 terabyte uh, Barracuda Pro. Uh, these are uh, 7200 RPM, uh, 256 megabytes of cache. These are covered by a two year warranty uh, when you buy from a retailer. Uh, they also have the same res rescue data recovery uh, that the Iron Wolves have, and uh, cause I recently did a review on the Iron Wolf 14 terabyte. Uh, these are actually filled, uh, well, they're actually sealed units, they actually come with helium inside. Uh, then the traditional ones, which uh, have the all oh, screwed together, you know, if you know what I mean. So these, these are sealed because they have helium in, all sealed all the way around. Whereas the other ones are like, are like screwed together. So let's put this on the PC uh, and I'll see you guys in Windows. Alright, so we're in Windows. We've just installed the drive. Uh, I actually forgot to mention that uh, at the time of this video, these drives are selling new on Amazon for £270. And uh, I did manage to find them on eBay for 250 that's if you want to take the risk on eBay to try and save twenty pounds, but uh, that's up to you guys if you want to buy one. So we'll set up the drive in disk management. Uh, like I said, just set up like any other hard drive. Go to disk management and like partition it off. And there we go. Now the drive is set up, and then what we're gonna do? That's now drive D. We'll go to Crystal Disk Mart like we did with the Iron Wolf the other day. Uh, and see what the write and read speeds are. So it's already set up to drive D and uh, we'll let that go. I'll also speed this up for you guys and uh, we'll come back with the results. Alright, so the results are in. Uh, and on the read side of things, we're looking at around 255. Uh, and on the writes, uh, we're looking at around 250. So I'll call that, you know, around 250 write and read speeds, uh, which is not bad, uh, but I've seen better with the uh, uh, 14 terabyte Iron Wolf. Uh, and uh, like I say, for the extra 90 pound that I, an Iron Wolf uh, 14 terabyte would cost, uh, you're getting about, around another 10 megabytes per second uh, write and read speed, uh, an extra four terabytes of actual storage, and uh, and, and the Iron Wars also have uh, one more year of uh, warranty as well, so you get three years of warranty with those. But let's do the uh, transfer file test, see how long that takes. So I'm going to do what I did with the Iron Wolf the other day, and I'm going to transfer across the Hail Mass Chief collection. Uh, which is 124 gigabytes of data. Uh, the time is uh, 3 uh, 12 pm in the UK right now, so we'll see how long this takes and uh, I'll time lapse this for you guys. Alright, so the time is 3.22, uh, so that took a little under 10 minutes to complete, um, which is about the same as what we saw in the uh, Iron Wolf uh, in, in terms of uh, write and read speeds. Um, so let's summarise the video guys. So that was a look at the 10TB Barracuda Pro. Uh, £270 new on Amazon. I'll have a link down in the description if you guys want to check it out. Uh, you might be able to pick a used one up uh, for even cheaper on eBay. But uh, in, in, here in the UK, I couldn't find any used ones on eBay. There are only new ones on eBay for £250. Uh, like I say, for the extra £90, you could buy an Iron Wolf 14 terabytes. Uh that has three year warranties, whereas this guy only has two years warranty. Uh, and also, 
you get the four terabytes extra and a, a little little bump extra in in speed. It's not a lot. It's like ten megabytes per second. Uh, but overall, this is a nice drive. Don't get me wrong. Uh, I'm just saying we've we've looked at ones that are better. Uh, but that's up to you guys. If you feel it's worth your money, then take a look. It link will be in description. Uh, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for all your support as always. And yep. Yeah. That is the 10 terabyte. In the next video, we'll be looking at the 14 terabyte Western Digital Red. So stay tuned for that. I just also want to add as well, guys. Uh, the uh, I've actually put it back in the sleeve, uh, but the warranty on these that I'm on about by saying two years is the uh, Data Recovery Rescue Warranty. These drives are actually have a limited warranty of up to five years. But what I mean by warranty, I mean by warranty by uh, if one of these drives dies, dies in your system, you've got a two years warranty, uh, like I said, for your pictures, your family photos, uh, let's just say you've got some important files on there, uh, and that's what most people are borrowed about. But as, as, like I said, if you do have a failure on one of these drives, uh, you are backed by a five year warranty, or limited warranty by Seagate. Uh, but when I refer in this video to the two-year warranty, but if yes, the three-year warranty, uh, I'm actually on about the uh, data rescue plan that you actually get when you buy these drives. So I just want to clear that up uh, before this video goes out. Thanks for watching.